Hello. Have your embedded system projects ever faced a resource crisis? Your design is currently using more memory, gates, power, or time than is available. Your project is at risk of failure. Let's talk about design techniques that can rescue your project. Mixed precision techniques are conceptually like a design knob. Turning this knob can dramatically reduce resource consumption, thus making a project successful. Mixed precision techniques can reduce resource crises on any target. A microcontroller using C code, an FPGA or ASIC using HDL, or a GPU using CUDA. Mixed precision save re saves resources for all numeric modeling approaches, floating point, fixed point, and designs that mix both simultaneously. Mixed precision is built on two key aspects. First, based on the needs of the application, select data types for key signals and parameters that are neither wastefully big nor uselessly small. Second, for temporary calculations, leverage chip math capabilities that are fast, low power, and high precision. Mixed precision has been a proven path to embedded success for decades. Classic DSP chips led their markets with mixed precision. Not to be left behind, modern microcontrollers and FPGAs have all adopted this capability. Deep learning can achieve breakthrough results, but it can be incredibly resource greedy. These two facts have led to an explosion of new chips aiming to exploit the proven benefits of mixed precision. As this model of an NVIDIA Tensor Core shows, Mixed precision floating point is now an option too. Fixed point designer provides a rich set of tools to achieve mixed precision efficiency for any design. Yes, any includes floating point. If that surprises you, then I invite you to visit the product page and learn about designers expanding optimization capabilities for floating point. Let's look at a few examples. A user recently came to us with a resource crisis. Their ARM-based motor controller was much too slow. We recommended they use our tool that searches for an optimal mixed precision design. The new graphical interface shown on this slide makes it easy to see that many feasible solutions were found and the best was applied. For the user's 380 block motor controller, the optimization search produced a mixed precision design that was eight times faster and solved their crisis. Over the last couple years, we've encountered many crises like the one shown here. A user's initial design seemed hopelessly big for the intended FPGA, but hopelessness was not an option. The user had to so have a solution we were eager to help. So our team dug in to find all the opportunities to exploit mixed precision and hardware-friendly algorithms. From this effort, we developed a lot of very efficient building blocks. But did that matter? Yes, it did matter. Resource consumption was reduced by over 130x. This huge reduction left lots of room for all the other components that also needed to fit on the chip. I'm happy to report that the building blocks supporting that success are now available to all of you. This slide shows a sampling of the capabilities in the new Fixed Point Designer library. Deployment of machine learning algorithms is hugely valuable, but Meeting the tight resource constraints 
of embedded real-time is a big challenge. To meet this ongoing challenge, our approach is to invest in new tooling. Through data collection, this tooling is able to provide insight and recommendations on an advantageous mix of floating point and fixed point. Quantization tooling for use with Deep Learning Toolbox and GPU Coder is available in 20A. Our testing shows a high percentage of networks can leverage quantization with only a small impact on accuracy. The initial version of the quantization tooling is able to achieve efficiency improvements in the range of 30%. We're aiming for even greater leverage of mixed precision techniques in coming releases. Let's finish with an example that impacts all designs and all targets. The problem is it takes too long to move large parameters from storage memory to compute memory. A simple approach to solving this crisis is to use re reduced precision for big parameters. For parameters with values less than 65,000, half precision floating point can be an easy way to improve speed by 2x. Half is already available for use in MATLAB and is newly available in Simulink. For even greater compression, smaller fixed point types can be used. The next time you have a resource crisis with your floating point or fixed point design, please check out the latest mixed precision optimization tools found in Fixed Point Designer. It can be your easiest path from failure to success. Thank you.